Where's Mum? I told you, mate. She had to leave early for work. Where's your bag? It's upstairs. If she's not here in the morning, she usually calls. Just go and get it, eh? Otherwise, you're going to be late. I can't stand this. Well, it's a marriage breakup, my love. It's not going to be a bed of roses. You did the right thing. Yeah. I'm lying to Noah. No idea where charity is. Lost for good. Yeah. Doing great. Hey! Let's go. Bye, Noah. Bye. You're uh, very dressed up for a scan. Yeah, I'm uh, meeting Ruth later. Oh, Priya, I'm delighted. Honestly, if I was a few years younger, I'd be after him myself. Oh. Anyway, it's very good to see that you put David out of your mind. Oh, Jimmy, please, we make me a coffee. I really need a coffee. Where the hell have you been? Found a little bar in Hutton last night, didn't I? Real dive, it was vile, I had a brilliant night. Right, and you, you do remember that you've got a kid, you, you know that, yeah? No, it's fine. He doesn't even know I've left yet. So, you know what, Jay, we'll just tell him that I had to get up for work early or something. Right, sorry, but lying to your kid, maybe not the best plan. Oh, Mr James, good. I was hoping you'd chip in with some more advice. Mum, you... Last really night, last didn't... night, I needed to go out, I needed a night out, yeah, so last night I told a complete stranger my whole life story. I got completely slaughtered, and now I'm moving back in with you. So, you know what, I'm fine. No, Mum, you're not fine! Dad, please. Please don't give me a hard time, all right? I'm just about holding it together here. And no, I haven't forgotten about Noah, and I am well aware that, once again, I'm going to be the one breaking his little heart later on. Why are we here? Me and Jay have had a right, babe. Why are you always arguing? Well, there's a bit more to it than that, actually. It's stupid! We'll be moving back next week anyway. No, we won't. I'm sorry, Noah, but it's really actually over at this time. Let's get inside, eh? You're a rubbish, Mum! You're always messing up my life. I'll come round. Hey, give me them. Thanks, baby. Okay. My son's lost his dad thanks to you. I, I know, and I'm I'm sorry. And that's it. Seriously, you're sorry. As far as I'm concerned, Jay made the right choice. Now, if you're going to lose your act with anyone, do it with him. Just leave me and Archie out of it. If you come to beg, you can save your breath. I'm not. I brought some of your stuff. <sighs> right, thanks. Anything else? Can I come in and say Noah? Say goodbye. No. Come on, Charity, please. I told him how you lied to him this morning and how you've actually been lying to both of us for months and he said he hated you. At least let me see him. Let me try and explain. He's only nine, so he probably didn't mean it. But you know what? I'm going to keep telling him that you've chosen Archie over him. And by the time I've finished, he'll mean it because he'll feel it in his heart and he'll hate you as much as I do. Why would you be so cruel? To protect him. I don't want him feeling anything for you. You've broken his heart too many times. Never again. <laughs>